An elderly woman still recovering after being attacked by a dog on the 4th of July. We've been telling you about this. Happened in New Haven, and tonight we're hearing the 911 calls that came in that day. Here's News 8's Stephanie Simone. What is me? All you hear is barking and screaming. Hubinger Street neighbors rush to their phones as 78 year old Patricia O'Brien is mauled by this pit bull, Shasta. Hello? Yes, what is the dog bite? Six, seven. Please, what is it? The dog bite dog. Please, get here quick. Okay. Please. All right, I'm, I'm getting the call in now. A Spanish speaking caller says the dog is biting her neck and pleads for help. Okay. Okay. Please, please, please. Attack someone. A dog attack someone. All right. Uh, is there a Florida department or are you out front? Uh, we're in the backyard. Mr. Union ambulance right now. New Haven police say Shasta's owner was introducing him to their new landlord, O'Brien. The dog attacked. I think anytime a, a, any animal is put in an unfamiliar situation, uh, it may show signs of, you know, being protective. Since that day, Shasta has been in quarantine at the New Haven Animal Shelter. Officer Manganello says he's been well behaved here. In some cases, the animal will be released with restraining orders. Such as having muzzles, different things like that. And in some cases, if it's a severe situation like we've had in the past, uh, we may not release, we may choose not to release the dog and, uh, you know, with our feelings that it may not be safe in the public. They still have to wait another week of quarantine until they figure out exactly what's going to happen to the dog. But for the owner of the dog, police say she will not be charged in this case because the dog was not loose. It was on private property. In New Haven, Stephanie Simone, News 8.